shepherd me, O oh God, beyond my wants, beyond my fears, from death into life. All I want to do is make you proud of me. I don't wanna love nobody but you. I don't wanna love nobody but you. I don't wanna love nobody, love nobody but you. <laughs> what up, y'all? Martech79 here. Yes, man. Yes, I've fallen into the social media trap of society. I finally, you know, when all this craziness for these two chicken sandwiches came out, I was like, I'm not gonna do this. I'm not gonna do this. I'm gonna be myself. <laughs> but I couldn't help it. I was hungry. It's lunchtime. I'm ready to eat. So, y'all know the drill, man. Y'all know the last week, uh, Popeyes came out with their brand new chicken sandwich and set uh, social media on fire. So, we have just the regular chicken sandwich here. Um, we got the bun here. <laughs> I've never done a food review before, man. So, you know, just bear with me here. Uh, we lift up the flap here. Uh, we got some mayonnaise action going on there. Looks like a buttered bun. We got the chicken patty here. Looks like it's breaded. Looks good. Uh, we got some pickle action there. Some mayonnaise. Looks kind of the mayonnaise looks a little suspect there. Looks like the pickle juice has soaked into the patty. So you know, <laughs> it is what it is. It's, it's still gonna taste good. I can hardly wait. And then we have the ye old favor here, the Chick-fil-A chicken sandwich here. Uh, dry, no condiments on the top here, just a bun. Uh, but, you know, Chick-fil-A has like a thousand sauces. I personally prefer the Chick-fil-A sauce on my sandwich. We got some right here, so I'm going to save that for a, little, for a little bit later, though. And then we lift up the bottom here, then we have our two pickles just kind of stacked on top of each other. Then we have our beautiful breaded uh, Chick-fil-A patty right here as well looking good so if I had to judge the buns here I think I kind of prefer I mean just based off of looks I think we can see the Popeyes bun kind of holds together a little bit better more so than Chick-fil-A's bun uh, Chick-fil-A's bun just looks like a regular uh, just some buns that you just get from Kroger's or something man the, the minute I, I don't know it held its it held its form so but when it comes to the meat patties though or the chicken patties uh, you know lightly breaded uh, it's, a, it's a little bit light and you know like I said the condiments and the pickle juice has soaked into it so I think that kind of kills the look of it a bit and uh, then we have our beautiful Chick-fil-A patty here and then we lift, lift up the bottom there still holds up pretty well a, a little bit darker so I wonder if that has to do with like the seasoning or the breading or if they just cook this chicken patty longer than this one curious uh, bottom of the bun bottom of the bun alright man I'm ready to eat so we're going to take a bite of our Popeye's chicken sandwich first um, I'm not gonna show myself eating because I don't know I just think that's weird so <laughs> I'm gonna tell I'm gonna take a bite and then I'm gonna tell y'all what I think about it right off the bat you definitely get that I mean if you've ever had Popeye's before I mean you've had their chicken breast you kind of know the flavoring that you're getting so I hate to say it, man, but I don't know. It's a little bit. It's got a decent flavor to it, but I mean, the hype that this sandwich was was getting. <laughs> to be completely honest, man, I don't know. I kind of got a little bit of a bland flavor from me. Yeah, it tasted a little bit, a little bit bland. I don't know. Like I got some pickle in my bite, chicken mayonnaise. Yeah, it was a little bit bland for me. I mean, the chicken. Itself, it was a it was a healthy piece of chicken, um, white meat, not really any craziness going on there. Uh, pickles came out good. The, the, the pickles tasted fine. It kind of had a, a little bit of a sweet flavor to the pickles, I would say. Mayonnaise, I, I really didn't taste the mayonnaise at all, to be honest. So, kind of kind of pointless. Um, but yeah, but the most important thing, oh, the bun was good. The bun actually tasted, it kind of had a, like a little fluffy, sweet taste to it too. So, so I feel like that came out good. But the chicken patty, yeah, man, I feel like it was just a little bit flavorless. I mean, you kind of got a little light uh, glazed uh, of the chicken 
flavoring just yeah it was a little bit bland maybe a little bit of salt this could definitely use some pepper some salt maybe some hot sauce or something um, maybe some barbecue sauce or something yeah I would definitely if you're gonna get this sandwich or if I if I were to get this sandwich again I would get it plain with the pickles and then add on my own condiments like barbecue sauce or you know some mayonnaise some good some good mayonnaise somewhere of that of that nature yeah so all right let's move on to the uh, old faithful the chick-fil-a sandwich here okay so I can already tell you that flavor alone Chick-fil-A is still the is still the king of chicken sandwiches, man. I don't know what it is, what kind of breading and seasoning that they use for their chicken patty here, but it's just better. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> it's so good. The pickles are good. The bun is good, light, fluffy. Chicken patty tastes amazing. You know, like I haven't even put any like sauce on it or anything. And it's so good. So yeah. I don't know. Definitely, uh, I think most people are just falling for the social media hype of this chicken sandwich here. But my personal opinion, if I had to judge between the two here, I would still go for the Chick Fil A sandwich. Dum dum dum. <laughs> Sorry, man. It is, it is what it is. Um, this one retailed for like three seventy nine after after tax and then the Popeye's chicken sandwich was like 4 20 26 after after tax so yeah man if I had to but I think this one this sandwich might be a little like a hair bigger per se yeah but if we're if we're talking about flavor within the chicken patty definitely chick-fil-a wins but I do prefer the bun to Popeye's so maybe if we take this bun and put it on this chicken patty and then I, I would say keep the chick-fil-a pickles too and then add some Chick-fil-A sauce to it. I think we would have our perfect fast food chicken sandwich right there. Yeah. <laughs> That's how I feel about it, man. So, all right. So, I'm going to finish my lunch here. Appreciate everybody watching. We'll get back to form on the next video, I promise. But I, I just had to get this video out from the media storm hitting these two chicken sandwiches. I'm glad I, I'm, I'm glad I did it. And, I mean, and you know, it's not to say that this was a bad chicken sandwich. Uh, I would I would eat this again. I don't know if it's something particular that I would order from Popeye's. I think I would just really prefer their bone-in fried chicken instead of the instead of the chicken sandwich but but when it comes but if these two restaurants are like right next to each other and i'm really craving a chicken sandwich chick-fil-a is, is still is still the king man it is what it is all right man as always so you can follow me at youtube.com slash smartjack79 i'm also on facebook instagram and twitter uh yeah and as always i will see you guys on the next video i'll catch you guys later bye